sad entertainment news now. The entire industry has lost another legend. Menzi Ngobani will be laid to rest today in Ladysmith in KwaZulu-Natal. His colleagues saying he'll be remembered for his passion for the industry, his talent, and also he was incredibly charming. Uh, to uh, look back on the life and the work of the uh, legend himself. I'm joined by a man who spent many, many a year working alongside him. It's a, a huge pleasure to have Tsepo uh, Inzamande joining us uh, this morning. Tsepo, good morning uh, to you. Thanks for your time. Uh, first of all, condolences to not just you, uh, but your friends and, and those who knew uh, Menzi so very well. Uh, how are you doing today, knowing today is, is the final goodbye? Uh, uh, thank you very much. Uh, thank you for having me. And first of all, I would like to say uh, condolences to the family of Ungoops. Uh, this is the, the way I used to call him, Ngoops, as Ngubane. Uh, it's very, indeed, it's very sad. And thank you very much for your condolences. Uh, it, it's, it's, it's really shocking uh, to be sitting here and talking about his passing. I think it, uh, it's, it's, a, it's a loss, and it's very sad, you know. I mean, men were still young at 56. I mean, I'm 54 this year, and I was still expecting a lot on him, you know, from him, you know. Uh, it, it, it's very difficult. I don't know what to say. Tell me then about, I'm sure it's very difficult to talk about, especially on, on live television. Tell me then, uh, um, tell me about uh, some of the, the, the standout highlight moments with him. I mean, he was, as I said in the intro, an incredibly charming man. People that I've spoken to who knew him uh, say he had an incredibly funny side uh, as well. Tell me about one of the happier moments that you remember uh, from him. Let's not all be too sad and uh, doom and gloom. Well, Menzi, he had taste on, on, on fashion. You know, uh, that's one thing he, I, I learned from him, you know, that I, I took from, I met Menz in 1989 when we were doing his Ketele, which it was a youth drama. And we, we all were taken by the way he dressed, uh, whether offset or onset, because if in the wardrobe, he, he will be very selective uh, on his wardrobe. And he, 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 he came with the name that says, in Sizulu, it, it says, I'm full of very TV, or I don't want to appear on TV, you know, looking funny, mm. uh, if, if I can put it in English. But we, we took that, 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 that weight and we use it every time we, we meet to, together with Lindan and Gossi and Caroline Fass and all the guys. We will say, no man, hey, this makeup, uh, makeup artist or this uh, wardrobe lady, she wants us to look, to look like Simbashil. You know, Mbasha is more like somebody who's like dirty and uh, not on character, you know. So I, those are the things I will remember with Menzi. But lately, I, I met with Menzi in 2019 in Mill Park in one of the banks. And we spent about 20 minutes uh, talking inside the bank. Even the lady who's working at the bank, she offers tea, you know, because that's the way they loved Menzi. She offered tea. And he, he, he came out to me and he told me about his sickness, which I cannot divulge here. And after that, I felt, you know, very bad about the way the media or some of the people were, were, were talking about it. And they didn't know the reality of, of what is going through. And it saddened me, uh, you know, to, to see that uh, he has passed on. I don't know what to say, really, mm -hmm. because he was, I, I know the means that is always happy, the means that even the issues of salaries, uh, uh, payments in the uh, film industry. I remember when the issue of his, 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 his uh, thing with generation, I knew that man was not going to stay, you know, because he shared some of the things that were happening. And I knew that when it comes to salaries, he was really not happy the way we don't uh, get respect, whether it's from the government or whether it's from the production houses that we work with. We, he has never been happy, and I'm one of the people who have never been happy about the, the treatment that we get. It looks glamorous outside to the people, but they don't know what we go through as actors and as musicians and as producers of artists. We, we, we're really suffering when it comes to the respect that we, we, we deserve to get from production houses because we are the face of the industry. We are the people who are selling their content. We are the people who are selling the scripts that they are writing. 
but the respect and the, 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 the earnings that we get, really, it, it's something that we need to sit down. And we've been complaining uh, about this for years, for years. And if we don't have a political will to change this situation, then we're going to have a problem. Now, I, 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 I want to recommend the, the Menzies brother's speech yesterday uh, when, we, when there was a memorial service. He was very honest and open. Now, now people are phoning in and they want to be on the program, they want to be. But after the funeral, Menzies' wife and kids, they're not going to see those people anymore. They will never even answer their calls. And that's the situation we, the situation we have. But if we can end good pay, if we can end our, ri our rights uh, 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 and, and get what we deserve, mm. we won't bother people after. Our families will never bother people after we've passed on. Serpo, uh, and I think this is uh, I think what many people will remember Menzi for now, obviously you as well, uh, is fighting for, for better uh, working conditions for actors uh, in South Africa. It's a true legend we've lost, and I thank you for your time, uh, Serpo and Zamande, for speaking to us. I know it's a very difficult day uh, for you and, and the rest of the, uh, of the uh, television community in South Africa. Serpo and Zamande joining me via Zoom. Thank you very much, and once again, uh, my condolences on the passing of Menzi Ungabane. Uh, that uh, funeral is going to be taking place uh, today.